Now in this sum, we are given that triangle QRS is an equilateral triangle. If it is an equilateral triangle, then all the three sides are equal. And each angle will be of how much? 60 degree. We are given that it is an equilateral triangle. So an equilateral triangle is equiangular also. So each angle will be of 60 degree. We have to show what? That this arc RS. This is your arc RS. This arc RS. Fine. It is equal to which arc? It is equal to arc QS. This is your QS. And this arc is equal to arc QR. This is your arc QR. Then the th other thing that we have to show is that this measure of arc QRS, this much, it is 240 degree. So let us take the solution for this or the proof as triangle QRS is equilateral. Therefore, RS is equal to QS is equal to RQ. Fine. Therefore, now if the three sides are equal, means these are the chords of the circle. And we have studied a theorem that in the same circle or in congruent circles, congruent chords, they subtend congruent arcs. So therefore, I can write here, therefore, arc. For RS, the arc is RS, arc RS is congruent to QS, congruent to arc QS is congruent to arc RQ or QR. What is the reason you will write for this? Reason is in the same circle, in the same circle, Congruent chords subtend congruent <coughs> arcs. Okay, so your first part is proved. Now we come to the second one. As triangle QRS is equilateral. Therefore, it is equiangular. Equiangular means having same measures. Angles are same. Therefore, angle R is equal to angle S is equal to angle Q is equal to 60 degree. Now, if we consider this angle, angle Q, QSR, this angle. Measure of this angle QSR is half of the measure of the intercepted arc by inscribed angle theorem. So using this theorem, we will find out the measures of the arcs. Okay. So angle QSR is inscribed in the arc. In which arc? Inscribed in the arc QSR and intercepts. Intercepts means cuts. Intercepts arc RQ. Therefore, angle QSR is half of measure of arc RQ. What is measure of angle QSR? This angle S is QSR. It is 60 degree. Right? Angle QSR. See in the figure. QSR. That means angle S. Its measure is 60 degree. So, is equal to half measure of arc RQ. So, 2 into 60 is measure arc RQ. So, 120 degree is your measure of arc, arc. Fine. Now, similarly, we can say 
that measure of arc this rs that will also be 120 this is 120 just now we have shown this is 120 degree right okay 120 plus 120 is how much 240 and we need to find out this arc qrs getting that so similarly measure of arc rs is equal to 120 degree therefore what is measure of arc qrs see this arc qrs this is your arc qrs so measure of arc qrs it is made up of two arcs qrs is made up of two arcs arc qr plus arc rs is measure of arc QR plus measure of arc RS by reason is by arc addition property. So that makes 120 plus 120 that is 240 degree. Hence proved. We have to prove that the measure of this arc is 240. Okay.